still undefeated. But what was it like in there? Was Francis Ngannou better than you thought? Fighter, yeah, he's a good fighter, Francis. He uh, hit me with some good punches, and he was a lot better than we thought he'd be. Good fighter. You've been down against two of the hardest punchers ever. Yeah. Deontay Wilder and now Francis Ngannou. How hurt were you in that third round? Uh, just a flash knockdown behind the head. I think it was like a glancing blow at the back of the head, and it was what it was. It was all right. Now, in your corner, Sugar was telling you not to engage. Was it about saving the December 23rd date, or why was that the plan when it seemed like it was a close just, fight? Just boxing, you know? I was just using my jab boxing at the end of the fight there, not getting involved in a brawl, getting cut or whatever, right at the end of a fight. Obviously, offensively, you were not surprised by his power. Defensively and boxing skill-wise, yeah. what was it that made him tough tonight? Listen, he was a good fighter. No excuses, he's a good boxer. He's a lot better than I thought he'd be. Um, and he, he gave me a good fight. Fair play to him, God bless him. Did he surprise you a little going southpaw? Uh, no, he was a uh, was good, good fighter. I was, it was surprising. Alexander Usyk ringside, he's right there. Is that still what's next for you, or is there a rematch looming? No, there's no rematch clause either way. Listen, I would like to do it again down the line, and um, I'm sure Francis would like to do it as well. But uh, we got this man to deal with next, and uh, that's what's next for us. Could tonight's version of Tyson Fury defeat the best version of Alexander Usyk? Yeah, for sure. Listen, he's a smaller man than um, Francis. I always said Francis was a much more dangerous fight than Alexander. Um, and that's it. 